Uh, we have another statement in our position which we can uh, you know now put out exclusively with times now and this is the statement of uh, uh, of pradeep vagmare he is the person pradeep vagmare is in fact the housekeeper for indrani and uh, peter's household he's been uh, there for many years now what we do understand after reading this particular uh, statement by pradeep vagmare which is again a statement that has been given to the cbi by this housekeeper he throws lights on very very crucial aspects now so yesterday when we put out the uh, you know uh, the statement of rahul and vidhi in yesterday's statement it was quite clear that perhaps peter had a fair idea of what was going on in the household with regard to shina bora now if i read out from this particular statement and i will the statement actually does talk about uh, you know the various instances where it talks about how peter and indrani sort of reacted to uh, the entire uh, sequence of events when it comes to and this one uh, what i'm talking about is is after the disappearance of sheena when rahul keeps coming back to the house again and again and keeps asking for sheena so you know the major point of course at the beginning he uh, pradeep agmari is telling how he got in touch with uh, peter and indrani how he joined star india as a housekeeper it he talks about and i'm going to take you to the very crucial point he talks about uh, 25th of april 2012 which is a day after of course uh, sheena has gone missing the day after the murder he says and he is uh, the premise here is that he is talking he is saying that rahul has been coming to the house again and again asking for sheena so he says that one instance when rahul has already uh, all over again driven to the marlow bungalow in worli of peter and uh, indrani he says i he saw rahul coming he says i informed rahul mukherjee and i'm going to uh, you know show the statement to you he says i informed rahul mukherjee that i'm looking after the work of the cleaning of the above flat upon that rahul asked me that where is his sheena i replied that since i had not visited the said flat for the last 2 3 days i'm not able to tell anything about it after that rahul returned back by his car i advanced to his flat number 19 which was found open this is the flat of indrani and uh, uh, peter he says nobody was there As soon as I entered into the said flat, I saw a number of container, dabba packed of non-veg boiled rice, pulses, etc., in a decomposed condition, were found kept lying in the kitchen, and bad smell was coming out. In the toilet, nighty was found lying on the floor. Half-consumed water bottles were also found. He says, however, now this is where he actually is talking about. It could be Sanjeev Rai, we or it could be anybody else. We do not know. Was this Mikhail? Was this Sanjeev, Sanjeev Karna? We don't know. He says, however, I saw a new Hawaii chappal. slippers of gents in black color lying on the floor of the room it is pertinent to mention here that when i visited the said flat on 22nd for 2012 for cleaning work no such hawaii chappal of any gent was seen by me on that very day when madam came back to mumbai i showed her the said chappal to her and by seeing the same she instructed to throw this chappal immediately and then he of course talks about in the meantime rahul came here and started to quarrel with security guard and wanted to know in the said flat for tracing out sheena bora guard did not allow him in so this this episode has happened when rahul has been coming back again and again and the guard doesn't allow him in and you know he's been fighting with the guard outside at the marlow building 